someone who suffers from anxiety disorder, so I actually uh, go to therapy and I have to take medication every day. So and this is sort of like a not a full bio photography, but sort of like sort of based on my own experience. I hope that um, the story and our film will bring across the idea to people that. Um, you know, whether you're suffering from mental health conditions or you are someone who might, might have a friend or family member who's suffering from such conditions, uh, you know, you can reach out to each other. A friend of mine told me that uh, he, he actually knows Yong Ping, so um, he, he, he actually told me like, oh, um, you know, um, they are looking for actors to, to, to play this character and they, um, he, he actually told me, um, do you want to try it? So I, I had a thought about it and it, uh, I, I heard that it's about uh, a person who is suffering from anxiety and uh, I thought maybe I should give it a try. This film uh, has surfaced <coughs> a lot of my own fears yeah, and also made me um, become more aware uh, of what I think I need to do to prepare myself for the years. Come, can, can we talk? Mm. Personally, I'm a content creator and also like, um, like I call myself a filmmaker so I'm constantly looking out for stories and also like especially things that are about human connections and this is uh, a subject that I've been um, exploring a lot even in the, the narratives that I'm, I'm doing. This thing about uh, keeping a connection, a human connection, uh, goes way, way beyond uh, therapy and, and medicine. When you when you have uh, a mental illness, you know the people around you is also uh, equally important as the as the person who is uh, having this uh, uh, mental health condition. So um, I hope that. Um, people will start to be start to take more notice to their loved one uh, around them and ask them how they are doing. Hey Mr Chen. So um how's everything so far? Recently yeah, I came very very close and actually enrolled myself for counseling. Uh, I think that uh, had I not sought help I think I wouldn't have been able to cope as well. It was like one of the darkest periods of my life and there was um, and I actually uh, suffered something uh, that I actually do identify as anxiety attacks. So um, they, they, they come uh, episodic like in, in episodic attacks and and um, these are actually not very pleasant things to represent but um, in approaching the, the script and also like the character I have to put myself to recall these things in order to do the character justice. You don't have to be a doctor to reach out to your friend, to reach out to your family member. You know, it, 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 it's not, it doesn't all fall on the doctor and medicine or, or, or the therapist. You know, we, we can all be there for the people around us in our lives. Anyway, anyway it's, it's susceptible to, to this illnesses so especially in, in this stressful uh, society right now so yeah mm, ho hopefully this film will make people care about each other more be more kind to each other i hope that uh, whoever watches it will start conversations about mental health issues uh, it should no longer be a taboo to talk about mental health issues it is not uh, disgraceful it is not a shame to be suffering from mental health issues or to have friends or family members who have mental health issues. Approach the subject gently, but do it. I think it's important to find out uh, what's happening with the people in your life. If you are suffering, uh, do not suffer alone. Uh, reach out to people. Um, in fact, um, you are not sharing your, your misery. You are actually allowing someone else to not have to suffer the consequences of you not stepping out to, to solve these issues together.